I don't know how to do this. My son, he's um, taken off. It seems like he's a little delusional. He says, you know, he feels immortal and like a superhero. So I'm just, I don't know what's going on with him. And he was out to dinner with his dad today and he took off. He left on foot? Yes. He had no ID on him, no phone. We'll say, I think the only thing he has on him is a pocket knife switchblade. So you, you, you panicked at that point? Yeah. Did you run? Yeah. So you ran down that street, and is that when you saw the open garage door? Yes. When you ran up into that garage and the woman was there, were you running to her for help? I don't think I ran up to her. I think I just, I think, I just screamed that, and then it's a blur. Do you recall the first thing you said to them or they said to you when you came walking up? All I remember was there was a woman in the garage. I was screamed at, I guess. Well, I didn't know this, but apparently I didn't have my pants on or shirt on. Do you remember when you took your clothing off? I have a, like, I didn't remember it at first, but I have a faint memory of taking my pants off at some point before I saw Daniel, but I never realized that my clothes were off later. Like, like it's, it's hard to explain. Right. It's, it kind of runs together for you. Yeah. Do you remember what happened next? Not, no. I, I don't, I don't, like I have some memory of what happened, but I don't remember how we got in, into the altercation. Do you remember her husband coming out? Yeah. Do you remember what he said? No. Do, do you remember that you used a, a weapon? I remember using a machete. Do you remember where you got it? I think somewhere in the garage. I don't know. I think in the left, left corner or something. I don't know. Do you know why you picked it up? No. Did you want to hurt and stab the neighbor that came running over? Well, the report is that you stabbed him multiple times, and he heroically tried to save those people. He was severely wounded. I don't remember fighting him or stabbing him. When you went in that garage, did you drink something in that garage that you found there? I don't want to talk about that. You had severe burns to your esophagus, right? Yeah. And do you know what caused you to go into a coma? I didn't know at the time, but I guess I know now. Mm -hmm. And what have they told you caused you to go into the coma? Whatever I drank. Okay. When you left the restaurant that night, the night of the incident, were you confused? Or were you thinking straight in your opinion? I don't remember thinking at all. I just, it's like a blur, sort mm -hmm. of. So I, I, don't, I don't think I was thinking straight. Did you leave that restaurant wanting to hurt anyone? No, no. Why did you do it? Do you think you're mentally ill? I guess so. Uh, 